she could not embody her blackness when she's part of that family. You can't, you know, you see Margaret Megan at Carnival. Like, you, you just, it won't happen. It won't happen. There's a word that we have which is called token, tokenism. Uh, the idea that just because you have a black face in the royal family changes the nature of the royal family, I think is problematic. To be accepted, uh, she has to fit into what the royal family is, what the royal family does. Uh, the royal family is white, the royal family does whiteness. The, the monarchy, the actual monarchy as an institution will make sure that she, uh, if you like, passes for white in terms of what she can say, who she can address. So the only way that she can be the princess is to downplay her blackness. It's not a case of how we just falling in love with somebody. Should have been extensively checked out, and the minute he looked at anything that was any darker than Meghan Markle, it would have been a definite no. Who Meghan Markle actually is the person nobody actually cares about. It's just the fact that she's married into the royal family, and she happens to be black. Coverage is basically focused on isn't it? Isn't it great that Harry's married her? There's another question: is why on earth is she marrying into the royal family? I think that's a question that most of that me and my family have all the time. If you was empowering your blackness, then would you want to um, be associated with the royal family? No, because that's built on racism, slavery, stealing jewels from Africa. You don't want to be associated with that. So when you have these symbols that make it look like things have changed and we can celebrate, that does more damage than it could ever do good because then we stop actually talking about the real problems which are affecting us in society. It's just convenient that she just happens to be quarter cast or part black and that's what we're all talking about now. Now we've got other things that we could be talking about and there were other statistics that show us actually what the problem is and we could be having a conversation about that instead but no, let's talk about Meghan Markle.